This is Boxing Heavy Bag Workout number four. I recommend a warm up of three three minute rounds with 30 second rests in between of shadow boxing before starting your heavy bag workout or training. Heavy bag rounds can be three, four, or five minute rounds in duration with 30, 45, or 60 second rests in between. Round one jab cross, two to fives. You're putting your jab crosses, your one twos, in combinations of two, three, four, or five. You can work both leads. You can work a one, two, a one, two, one, a one, two, one, two, or a one, two, one, two, one, or just the opposite. A two, one, a two, one, two, two, one, two, one, two, or a two, one, two, one, two, one. And twos through five combinations, straight punches. Full extension of the punches, keeping the hands up, the elbows tight, rotating on those crosses. Get in, get out, get into your strikes in the bag, move out, and move left to right, circling. Round number two. Long range combinations. Working your jab, crosses, hooks, uppercuts, overhands, shovel hooks. Getting into your attack, getting out, moving left and right. Staying grounded, keeping those knees slightly bent, rotating on your power strikes. Combinations of anywhere from two to six, seven, or eight punches in one combination. Changing the angles, keeping your hands up, your chin tucked. Keeping those knees slightly bent. As we call it, staying grounded or sitting down on those punches, developing more power. Strike through that bag and then get that quick retraction off the bag. Round number three, long combinations with head movement. So long range combinations and working your defense with your head evades. Head movement with slips left and right, weaves, pullbacks, or ducks. Working your combinations of anywhere from two to six to seven to eight punches in one combination. Get in, then get out. Get in for your attack, and then get out, move left or right. Keep that head movement. Sit down on those punches, rotate on your power punches. Keeping that head off center line. Working all different angles on those combinations. Round number four, a blitz round, power hooks. It's low, low, high, high. Lead body hook, rear body hook, lead high hook, rear high hook with a short pause in between as though you're clinching up with the bag. Keep those knees slightly bent, rotation, turn those hips, full body punches. This develops your punching power. You're punching as hard as you can. Again, working body, body, head, head. Changing stances. You can have your left foot forward, your right foot forward, or you can square your stance up. Round five, single power strikes. You can put these power strikes in one shots, two, or even three in a row. But you're throwing with as much power as you can, trying to develop your power and getting used to feeling how to hit as hard as you can. You can work your hooks. You can work straight punches. You can work shovel hooks. You can work overhands. Again, thinking you're going to punch as powerful as you can. Keep those knees slightly bent. Rotate on each punch so you get that full leg drive and hip torque. All about power, hitting through that bag. Again, you can do single power strikes, put them in the doubles or in the triples. Round six is what we call emptying the tank. You're relatively close to the bags, more in close range. Punch from all different angles and that's non-stop. Speed, power, rotation, hands up, changing angles. 
Hooks, uppercuts, overhands, shovel hooks, straight punches, jabs and crosses. But use those legs. After completion of your six rounds, get your one minute rest, three minutes of push ups, followed by another one minute rest, followed by abdominal routine number four. Hello everyone, Bruce Lombard here, owner of Lombard MMA and creator of Lombard MMA Fit. I'm hopeful this instructional video is helpful in your learning and your future application of the technique. Please use the comment section below if you have any questions regarding this technique or about your martial arts training and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Check out LombardMMA.com for hundreds of more instructional videos, more home fitness workouts, nutritional tips, motivational quotes training tips, and application strategies. Please subscribe to the Lombard MMA YouTube channel where you can get the most recent updates and new videos as they are posted. Thank you for training with Lombard MMA. Hope to see you back again soon.